to the Jake Games stream. Yo, what's happening, guys? Welcome back to another episode of The Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. Like always, if you guys have missed out on any episodes, you can go back, you can check out the playlist, and that'll get you uh, caught up on the ones that you have not yet seen. As for today, we're jumping back into the same old Jake the Mead world. I kind of have a little bit of a plan for today. Uh, so we've been having a struggle with the boss fight. And so what I think I'm going to do, I think I need multiple spears, like multiple. Uh, I think the armor set's not going to help me out much. I think I need multiple shields. If I can keep blocking, um, you know, when a shield breaks, just switch over to another shield. I think that's going to be the best method. So we're kind of set up right now with a sword, a spear, and two shields. I'm thinking we should get this out of here, right? We should get this out of here. I think maybe we have two or maybe even three spears and like three shields. And I think that should do it. How do I make the spears? I'm not sure if I can make the spears here. I may have to run back to... Uh, another base or something I think I might have to run to the elven zone what did we need in the elven zone uh, for another shield I need some more iron ingots we could probably make that probably have some of that we have bronze okay nice so we have bronze uh, let's see about making some iron maybe yeah let's craft iron ingot uh, let's add a couple of those and uh, that should be pretty good I think I need to eat something. Let's do some cooking. Um, so you say, can you play My Little Pony Simulator? It's your favorite. Uh, I don't know about that. I don't think that that's a game that I would um, play, you know, just for myself or for, you know, any kind of, uh, I, you know, I, I just, that's just not, if that's, if that's your thing, that's your thing, but that ain't for me. I'll tell you that much. But, uh, yeah, so that, that's probably a no-go. I think I'm going to eat some food, maybe have a nap, and then I think we should be good to go move on to get ourselves some good stuff. I can see about... I tried I tried getting the statues, actually. I didn't find any more statues, did I? Uh, armor's looking good. I could use a helmet. That's, that's what I never found yet. I never found a helmet yet. Let's put that away. We'll keep the torch on us. Pickaxe will keep on us. See, I'm just kind of getting this set up for the fight. I think I'm going to have like two, three spears, and I'm going to have like three shields, and I think maybe that will be what it's going to take to to get this fight done. Depends what it's going to take for me to make another spear. Can I see the recipe here? Um, or is there somewhere else I can see the recipe? Ingredients, creatures, or some gems. Ingredients? No. Weapons. No, see, it's just showing me stuff that I can craft right off the rip. It's not showing me, like, my better stuff that I can make. See, I wish I could just see, like, what, what I need to make this, you know? I want to know how you make more of this. I'm assuming I'm going to need some elven wood. So if I have elven wood, oops, that's not what I wanted. We'll grab some elven wood. I do have that. We'll grab some regular wood, not coinage. Regular wood, maybe hide. Lunda says he looks like a Viking, LOL, medieval game now, eh? Uh, so this is Lord of the Rings. You ever watch or read the Lord of the Rings books, movies? Um, he is a dwarf. And he's designed to look like me, except for I kind of got my beard trimmed because of, uh, you know, Ross wanted to see it, so. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, he's uh, he's dwarf dwarfed out. He has kind of got the medieval look to him. I know what you mean. I know what you're saying. But, uh, yeah, he's a dwarf. My dude do be a dwarf. I think that probably wood hide and elven wood, I think, should probably be what we're going to need. I could do with more hide, so maybe we can uh, chop some animals when we head out. 
So we've got iron, we've got bronze. Um, should I take some ore with me? I don't know. Uh, did you play MGDSV? What is MGDSV? What the heck is even that? Oh, we do need to sleep. Let's sleep uh, a little bit. And then we'll head out. Now we're hungry again, so we'll just have some mushrooms for breakfast. That's a pretty good breakfast, huh? Yeah, we've heard uh, that, Lunda. That is a bummer. Hopefully, uh, hopefully things improve for you, but I don't know. Uh, I don't know what to tell you, to be honest. I've never been in that type of situation, so I don't know what uh, what I could even say. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Or <laughs> what is wrong with these orcs? They're just like yeah. Metal Gear Solid. Oh, okay. I played one of them. Dude, I think it was like PlayStation 2. I played one of the Metal Gears. I I haven't really uh I haven't really dabbled in that much. I should have brought my torch. Did I actually bring the torch? I think I did. I got so many bat droppings. I don't think I need them, do I? We got to head back to the We got orcs. Why do we got orcs? What the fudge? Just trying to head to the Elven Zone. Was admitted last Christmas and I'm still here. Yeah, that's a bummer. Like I said, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, like I said, I've never been in that situation, so I can't really, you know, speak much to that. But it is a bummer. Hopefully, like I said, hopefully things get better for you. Nice. We're getting some hide here. Solid snake. Solid snake said, I wish I knew what to call you. Your name is just lines. What am I even supposed to call you? <laughs> oh, another one. He's just kind of, he was just kind of chill. I almost, I, I should have stabbed this deer. I should have stabbed him several times. I need to roll more, I think. Got him. Frig yeah, we got some more hide. I think hide's like key to crafting stuff here. Barcode? I'll call you barcode. Okay, sure. Barcode in the chat. I appreciate you watching. You've uh, you've been here a long time. You know, you've been chatting it up and stuff. I don't know if you've watched like other videos, streams and stuff. Have you been in the chat before? I don't recall. I'm under attack. Why am I under attack all of a sudden? Frig off, man. We don't need your attacking this. Quiet. I see prey ahead. Where? Oh, it is right there. Why is there prey in here? That's bonkers. But I'm going to stab it anyway. He ran right over the fire. That was a dingus move. Okay, we're going to get it. I'm trying to get as much hide as I can because that's always a big... <sighs> factor when it comes to crafting I would like to plan a little out for my mom's birthday in July uh, my Disney princess birthday in November but I don't know if I'll be out of here in time uh, watching while AFK and GTA online grinding cash oh I got you I've not played the GT uh, GTA either wait I can craft the last Alliance mall that's a tier two. I think my spear is also uh, tier two, isn't it? Tier two. Okay, so we can get a another weapon. And that might actually be a good thing. Shield wall. Regian spear, tier two. Piercing, bludgeoning. Okay, let's craft this. Oh, I can't craft the shield wall now. I'm going to have to run back. I can do another uh, Eregion spear, though. I'm going to do that. We're going to go back. We're going to get more bronze and more steel. And then we're going to come back. We're going to craft that. So we're going to we're gonna go into this fight. 
with this, this, and this, and then we're going to have three shields. And I think, dude, I think that might make it to where we can win this fight. I've been, I've been trying. I've been trying real hard to get past this boss fight because it's like my next, next step in progression here. And I've been struggling real hard. It's just like he does a lot of damage. I feel like I don't do that much damage. I'm trying to get these statues, man. I'm rebuilding these statues, but I feel like I'm just not getting things that I should be getting. You know what I mean? Like I'm missing a helmet still. I still don't have a helmet. Uh, barcode says this game has better graphics than Red Dead 2. Um, this is a newer game, so like it should have pretty good graphics. It's just, um, yeah, I don't know. It's just like a different uh, style also, you know? It's not the same kind of... Because, like, Red Dead... Honestly, Red Dead for the time, like, that's some seriously good graphics. Red Dead is pretty freaking spot on. Um, and for being, like, a very cinematic-based game, like, they, they do have some kind of crazy, crazy graphics. I think it was, like, what, 2018? But, yeah, this is a, this is a brand-new game, so, like, this should be top-notch, you know? And I'm running it on... Um, this PC is only, uh, is it a year old, maybe? I'm thinking, something somewhere around there. It's not a very old PC. Like This is a pretty relatively new PC. Uh, the graphics card is a 3070, so a little bit older of a graphics card. I didn't go with that new new. You have 5,300 hours in Red Dead. Holy crap. How is that even possible? Do you eat, sleep, dream, breathe, Red Dead? Like, <laughs> holy crap. Ooh, I got a meal. I don't know why I didn't eat that earlier. Okay, so what did I say I needed? I needed bronze and steel. Let's craft a couple of bronze. And uh, when that's done, we'll craft up a couple of steel store some stuff away we need to hide scraps I believe we'll take a little bit more of that I love these elven chests though because you can craft things with the stuff still in the chest that is like super freaking nice I love the fact that you can do that uh, where's my black diamonds there's five black diamonds uh, I kind of want to take inventory on my black diamond situation because I needed, what, 15 to get into the next uh, downward area, kind of? 6,000 plus in GTA 5. I'm playing it since 2013. Been modder in it in the old days. Oh, okay. Very nice. What kind of, uh, what kind of mods did you do? Band players in online. Such a great time. <laughs> yeah, I bet. The, the power. I can ban anyone I want. <laughs> um, all right, we'll grab a little bit of this. I'm trying to, I need to like kind of consolidate my inventory a little bit more, more better. I'm gonna do more better. So I actually have 13 black diamonds. Two more black diamonds, I think, because I needed 15 to unlock the elevator to the next like lower level so i'm actually today if we can beat this boss today then we're making progress we're gonna get i think we're gonna get black diamonds for that i mean that's usually a good uh um you know beating the orcs and the bosses and stuff i think that's a good way to get diamonds uh wakey been studying a lot uh what have you been studying you got like some tests coming up and stuff or you guys you guys do your summer breaks different right do, do you get like a sum is there do you have a summer break coming up or um did you already have it or like how is that how is that working for you i'm gonna repair my stuff also we just want to be going in with full full uh repairs here barcode says holy fartiosa <laughs> what, what is <laughs> fartiosa is that a uh, Harry Potter spell? Fartiosa? 
All right, that should be good on that, I think. We're going to make some more steel. This stuff all takes time, you know. It's kind of nice I get to chat with you guys while this is just kind of producing. You know what I'm saying? Have tests every two weeks from now on. We have our summer breaks in July. That lasts for a month, so generally the whole month of July. Okay, that's cool. See, like in the U.S., it's so much different. Like I think you guys get more breaks spread out throughout the year. In the U.S., it's like the summer break is – um, you get out in June, like the first week of June, and you're off until like uh, almost the end of August. So June, July, August, like you almost have three months. You basically almost have three months of um, vacation, summer vacation. But I think you guys have more frequent breaks throughout the year. So like it probably equals out to the same. Um, I don't know. Fardiosa. <laughs> Does fartiosa make somebody like fart their pants or something like is is that is that the spell? I have to I have to refresh my mind on Harry Potter. It, shouldn't there be more to it? Fartiosa sounds like kind of kind of weak. Well, he says, but I'm a senior, so I don't get summer breaks. Oh, okay. Well, you you're also doing like for us would be like college level courses, like university level courses, right? Barcode owns jet skis in summer to rent. Own seventeen, dude. That's awesome. That's that's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool business venture there. The next off day I get will be in December, Christmas or November festival, both being one day off. Dang, dude. That is bonkers. Uh, Barcode been working on that ten years, ten plus years. Very nice, very nice, dude. That's awesome. That's that's sick. That's cool, man. Jet skis are awesome. And uh, if you can make some money on renting them, like that's that's really cool. We're gonna make a little bit of iron too. I don't know that I needed it, but uh, you know, LOL Fartiosa. <laughs> Wakey says Fartiosa. Actually, <laughs> you guys like Fartiosa. Uh, Wakey never seen a jet ski. I've I've ridden some jet skis, dude. They're a lot of fun. Don't tell nobody, but I illegally rode a jet ski across the Canadian border. Like where I live, um, the, we have the lake between us and Canada. And so like I can ride out the lake into uh, Canadian waters. And I actually did that. I have a passport. I didn't have it on me when I was out there jet skiing. But, you know, uh, I did I did ride into Canadian waters on a jet ski. It was, it was a long freaking trip. And the jet ski that I was riding, it was like a, you know, a friend of my uh, brother's. We were borrowing them. And um, the one I had was having issues. Like running out, it seemed like it was running out of gas. Like I think the float in the gas tank was off or something. So it was saying I was out of gas. And we're like in the middle of the lake. You can like not even see land either way. I'm just like, oh no. Oh no, I'm going to die out here. <laughs> But yeah, they're they're a fun time. They're a fun time. Wakey says I'm actually trying to get enough money to buy a screen tablet for digital art. Yeah, you were talking about that before. That sounds awesome. Like a drawing tablet, dude. That'd be sick. Um, the heck was I gonna say? Oh, speaking of Fardiosa, what what do you guys think of? Uh, the Hogwarts uh, video game, the Harry Potter Hogwarts game, because I actually own that. There was like a big sale a while back, and that was one of the games that was on sale, so I picked it up just because I figured like, you know, I, I, there's a lot of games for me to, uh, that I have actually on deck that I can stream, so like whenever I finish stuff up, that's one that I could always pop into, just, you know, whatever you guys think. 911, what's your emergency? Some cowboy illegally riding jet skis. Well, the other thing, too, is I didn't have a license at the time. So I have no license, no boat license. I'm riding a jet ski uh, without a license, and I don't have my passport on me, and I'm in Canadian waters. Uh, <laughs> so <laughs> definitely, definitely a good time. Uh, Wiki says I'm 25% there. Nice. Okay, so... Not too shabby. You're getting there. You're getting there. Uh, 
Uh, it's okay, but I like other sandbox with guns more. Right. I got you. So you're like into the uh, the shooter games more so. Hogwarts Legacy, nice. Yeah, yeah. So I picked up Hogwarts Legacy. It was on sale, so like I got that. I got like a bunch of games when they were on sale. So I actually have a pretty good um, lineup of games that I can play. Like Cyberpunk, I picked up Cyberpunk for pretty cheap. Um, oh, there's a bear. Why has there got to be a bear here? Hogwarts Legacy. Um, there's a bunch of others. I'm not really like remembering at the moment what all I've got, but there is there's quite a few. I'm trying to like sneak past that bear without getting hit. Wait, he says, ah, barcode, I see, I see. Yeah, I've been calling, He. I was like, the whole time I've been streaming, he's been here, and I'm like, I don't even know what to call you. Your name is just lines. Uh, Wait, he says, to be honest, I want Elden Ring more than anything. Yeah, I, I haven't picked up Elden Ring yet, but that, the DLC is coming. Maybe that could be my next kind of thing. I'm sure there's going to be some, like, popularity with that when the DLC drops. So maybe that would be a good one to stream soon. But, uh... Yeah, I'm, I'm like nervous about that one because I don't think Ruzi's going to play it with me. I'm going to be on my own. And so like I'm very uh, kind of nervous about it. I'm not I'm not the best with uh, the Souls games. I've only ever played Dark Souls 3. Using this uh, tower shield, a single dwarf can defend an entire band from attack only one masterwork can be carried at a time oh okay so that's like a masterwork so i have to just hold that dude that's crazy still uh over anything i love our rdr2 says uh barcode yeah dude rdr2 is a freaking sick game when are you two butts gonna finish it takes two i don't know um like i was saying earlier Oh, that bear was tweaking out, man. I was just saying, talking about that earlier because uh, Turbo was in the chat. We were talking about that. It's like trying to find the right time when we're both available to do that is kind of rough. But, um, I mean, hopefully at some point. I think if we – I don't know how far in, how much more we have to go. I think if we do like a long day of streaming – we can maybe we can maybe finish it up. Uh, Barcode says anyway. I gotta go do a job at hotel maintenance. See you later. Thanks for a nice stream. Bye. Uh, yeah, thanks for coming by and chatting, Barcode. I appreciate that. You have uh, fun at your job. And um, yeah, take it easy, bud. Hopefully, we'll see you again in another one. Appreciate you. I don't want to get hit by orcs right now. I mean, if you're nervous with Elden Ring, you could warm up your reflexes with something like RDR2, Hogwarts Leg Legacy. You saying, like, before, like, in the same day, like, do a stream of RDR2 and then jump into that? See, it would be a good time because, like, the, the DLC is about to drop. But I also, like, I still have things that I'm, I like, I'm trying to maintain a two-stream or a two-game-per-stream day. So, like... Tuesday, I have Fallout New Vegas, and I have uh, Starfield. And now, Fridays, I have Red Dead Redemption, and I have Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. So I kind of want to keep that, um, I mean, getting used to quick reflexes. So finishing those first, right. Yeah, true. So, like, yeah, I'm trying to keep, like, the two, two game per stream um, schedule, kind of. So, like, if I can keep two... I'm playing Fallout New Vegas on Tuesdays. I'm playing Red Dead and Lord of the Rings on um, Fridays and Starfield on Tuesdays too. And then like when I finish one of those games, I'll add in another game. And um, it's nice that I have a bunch of games that I bought on sale because it's like I don't have to buy new stuff. I can kind of just start a new series without having to like actually purchase another new game. Because I mean these games are freaking expensive, man. You ever tried lychee? They're pretty tasty. What is that? Is that like a type of fruit or something? I haven't actually... I haven't tried very many like different exotic types of fruit. You know, like I'm kind of... I'm kind of basic here. I'm eating like strawberries and grapes and, um, <laughs> you know, blackberries, raspberries, like stuff that grows kind of local. Watermelon even, like, I don't know. 
like a berry quite a, uh, quite famous where I live. Yeah, see, that's the other thing, too. If it doesn't grow in the area or, like, if we don't have high demand for it, we're probably not getting it in our stores. I probably would like it. I do like a lot of berries, like strawberries, raspberries. Like, berries are kind of my favorite fruit. Pretty rare here as well because it's seasonal. Gotcha. Yeah, so, like, if it's rare there, then it's definitely not going to be here. Um, cause like here we have, uh, you know, like you, where you live, it's, it's warm all the time. Like I'm sure you have seasons where it gets cooler and stuff, but like here it's like, um, our winters last for quite a while and, uh, they can be pretty brutal sometimes. Like we've gotten lucky. We haven't had a bad winter in a while, but, um, you know, starting in the fall, it starts to get cool and then, November, December, January, February, March, like we usually, we can get snow, like fresh ones are rare, but you could get the package juice anytime. Yeah, true. I could try the juice. Should I try this hammer? Can do big damage, especially when armor is involved. Okay, nice. So this might be the good way to go against this feller. Long winters. Yeah, so, like, it's not always, like, you know, you get a, a good day in there, here and there. You might get, like, some days where um, the snow kind of melts, like, you get a, a clear day or a warmer day, but then it comes back. <laughs> but, like, lately, our winters have not been bad. It's kind of weird. I'm, it's, I don't know what, what the heck it is, man. Still haven't made butter chick? I have not. No. Thought it would be pretty good as a mead. That would be an interesting mead. Like, if I could get some juice. Let's well, see, that's all you need for making mead, too. Like, all I need was the juice. So if I can get some um, some juice, I could make that into a mead. For sure. 100%. Alright, so... We're gonna have to get into this fight. This boss fight here. So I might be a little bit distracted here for a moment. I'm gonna have to focus up. Yeah, because literally, like, what I do with my meads, I start the mead, and then um, when I rack it into another container, I add in, um, I add in like, fruits. Like, I'll add strawberries, berries, whatever. But I could do the same thing, but I could do it with juice. I could actually start the ferment with honey, juice, and water, and uh, I could make, like, a lychee mead with, you know, that, that kind of – I could do something like that. That would be pretty good as uh, waiting for a Jake cooking vid. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done a cooking vid. Uh, since Skyrim Meads and Meals. I need to, I do need to get back to that. The problem is I don't really have my own kitchen. Like, my cooking, if I'm going to do cooking, a lot of it is out of the van. So, like, I'm doing grilling stuff. So, I don't have, you know, like, it's, it's a little bit hard for me to uh, set up a kitchen for me to be able to do that. Starlink looked very cool, though, says Awakey. Yeah, Starlink is awesome, dude. I love it. Um, very next-gen, yeah. I got to get uh, my setup going right so that way I can stream this weekend. Like, hopefully tomorrow night I can do a late-night stream and uh, have my sound sounding all right. But All right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pop into this boss fight. We're going to frig this guy up. What sunlight feels like. We got orcs! It's Bulgak. Yeah. Oh, dude, it's killing him. Dude, this hammer was what we needed. I'm frigging him up. Look at that. I almost got him half health. Oh, yeah, dude. That's all I needed was a little bit of an upgrade. Bulgak, you're going down. Oh, dude, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting to go in swinging like that. No, you, Bulgak, dude. Look at your health. You'll fall like Azog. You will die. You'll die like any orc. I must die down. Dude. You'll never be rid of us in Moria. I had no idea. Knock this one dead. Awakey said, uh, look at that damage. Dude, I had no idea this freaking hammer did that much damage. If I would have known, I would have made that so long ago. 
Holy crap, dude. Iron, steel, hide, topaz, sapphire, black diamond. Oh, we got eight black diamonds. Was that the line of Azog just died? Was that like the end of the line of Azog? Dude, it destroyed that boss. So many times I ran into this fight with my freaking spears trying and trying over and over. All I needed to do was freaking make that hammer. I wish I would have known a long time ago. <laughs> God dang it, man. Dude, and I got all the diamonds I need. I can actually go on to the next level now. I can take the elevator down. Look at all these goods. Did I get a did I pick up like a key for this? Oh dude, three more black diamonds. Holy crap, dude. I have 24 black diamonds right now. I just got so much resources from that. I am like shocked right now. Definitely some great progress. That's all I needed, man. All I needed was to defeat that boss, and now we can move on. I feel like it's been a long time since we've actually been able to move on. Now just making that one freaking hammer just caused the destruction of a boss. And uh, now we can freaking move on finally. Is there anything through here, I wonder? Oh, I need a stronger pickaxe. Okay, so my next move is making a stronger pickaxe, which I needed some type of new wood, which I don't know how to get. I can get rid of these freaking spears, dude. They're not even necessary, to be honest with you. Like, we don't need all these butts, buttsy spears. Frig, man. All right, so now, um, do we head back to base, I think? Maybe drop some stuff off, or we're, at, we're out here. Maybe we can uh, try and find our way to that elevator. No, you know what? If we head back to base, we're going to have a fast travel. Uh, on the way back to base, there's a fast travel that'll take me right to that elevator. So I think that's probably the way to go. Now I gotta figure out that next pickaxe. Like, what is this next level of pickaxe? How the frig do I make it? The heck is the way out of here? Oh, it's back this way. Man, I'm I'm pretty happy with that, to be honest. Like that's I didn't know if I was ever going to get past that boss. You know how I am with bosses. What up, GamerZ? Welcome to the stream, buddy. How you doing today, bud? Glad to see you here. You guys know how I am with bosses. Like, it takes me a long time to get past bosses. Oh, I hate this. I didn't even realize GamerZ said, uh, hello there, General Kenobi. That's the correct response to hello there. I did want to check something out. So, like, there's an orc wood that you need to uh, progress. I'm kind of wondering, do I get that orc wood from destroying their stuff? Because I don't see no orc wood growing down here. No, that's just regular wood scraps. Where do I get the orc wood? Uh, Wakey says the tank top looking hella, uh, I, why did I even add hella? <laughs> looking slick as well. I'm like messing up my reading so bad right now. Tank top looking slick as well. So hot outside, bro, says Gamer Z. Well, if you guys are feeling hot, let me, uh, let me tell you about something here. We now, on the merch page, we have sleeveless merch. So you can get a Jake Games sleeveless shirt right now and uh, you can also get some hats some nice summertime gear if you want some wintertime gear if you're somewhere where it's a little colder get you some beanies but uh otherwise yeah dude check these these are these are pretty nice let me let me pull this out for you we're gonna take a quick pause here from the game and i'm gonna bust out these merch for you so whichever channel you're preferring to watch if you're a jake game uh viewer 
Then you've got Jake Chernisky, Shirts. From the main channel. Yeah, Gamer Z just helped with the advertisement. You've got Jake Games shirts. You got different colors you can get. I went with uh, white and black. Um, I don't know. I think those are the only two you can go with. Oh, wait, he says, don't stretch it. We can see through it. Does it really? Oh, it does, dude. It does get see through when you stretch. Oh, what the freak? <laughs> but uh, yeah, I think you can only do white and black, but you can do. Uh, Jake Chernisky channel, you can do Jake Games channel, and you can do white and black. So, yeah, check those out if that's something you're interested in. Heck yeah. Um, Larry Man's still here. He says, uh, new game, buddy. Yeah, we're on to Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. This is a great game. If you're into crafting, building, stuff like that, then definitely check it out. Gamers, you helped it. Yeah, you did definitely help with that merch advertisement. We will not talk about what we saw today. <laughs> well, I mean, if you go back on my main channel, um, there's like literally videos, a video of me showering outside. So <laughs> there, there is that. I mean, you guys, if you watch, if you watch the main channel stuff, you've seen, you've seen some things. I had to. Uh, so for some context, <laughs> it sounds so weird. Um, I had a hot, like there's an outdoor hot water heater. It's uh, by Coleman. And so I did a video testing it out. Like, you know, I do my videos where I test things out. And um, so the only beard, Jake. Yeah, yeah, that's that one should be on only beard. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I did a video testing out this Coleman hot water on demand water heater. So like I had to take a shower to try it out. So I'm outside, you know, with the van and stuff and I'm outside like showering with this hot water heater. It's, um, it was like cold too. It was like maybe towards the end of winter. So like it was as it was just starting to kind of warm up, but it was like, I don't know, maybe in the thirties. Oh, I need natural fibers. Okay. So I got to head back. Um, I have everything else I need. We needed black diamonds, elven wood, and natural fiber. So we're going to head back to base. And we're going to make some freaking... Uh, we're going to make some freaking progress, dude. There's actually like... Um, wait, was that the... Sh where did that, that short come from? I don't remember what short. Wait, did I go to the wrong place? I think I went to the wrong place. Yeah, I definitely went to the wrong place. I need to travel again. There's a short where it's like me and then my other version of me and I get interrupted by my other version of me. And it came from that video, I think. I'm trying to remember. I've done so many at this point. It's hard to remember like what all I've I've actually done. I'll have to look and see how many videos I've actually done on my main channel at this point. On this channel, I've done a whole lot of uh, videos. Um, what did we get natural fibers from? That was spiders, right? I should have a bunch of that, I think. Hopefully I have enough. Where is it at? Natural fiber. Oh, I got 51 just right there. Okay, we're good. We're freaking chilling on the natural fibers. I think, what can you hold? The 99 stack? Why does Minecraft... Okay. So, we have a problem with storage in Minecraft. Like, everybody knows it. It's definitely out there. Minecraft's doing their updates. They already know it. Like, we have, we have a problem with storage, right? So... Why does Minecraft not introduce a 99 stack uh, system? Would that not make sense? 99 stack system. Because then, you know, 99 cobblestone, 99 of whatever other stone, you're going to have um, much better storage, you know? 
meal ready. We're gonna have a little bit of breakfast. I love eating just a nice roast meat for breakfast. And then we're gonna head off to uh, to the place. But before we do that, I'm going to take a quick little intermission. I will be right back. I'm back. All right, let's go. Let's freaking progress to this next zone. I'm ready. No more waiting. It's been long enough, man. We've we've all wanted to get there. We've wanted to get to that next zone. Now we're finally going to freaking do it. I should have built a... Way says I'm going to be lurking. Need to do the chem. Alrighty, buddy. Appreciate the lurk. And, uh... You have you have fun. You're gonna do some like uh, some studying. Is that what it is? Oh boy, I gotta remember how to actually. Oh wait, what the fudge am I doing? Why am I running, dude? I really I'm dumb. <laughs> I have a fast travel point right back to that crystal uh, descent, and here I am like trying to run there. when I could just literally fast travel. Now we can go to Crystal Descent. Yes, let's go. I might want to set a base up here. I've had that base down like at the beginning of the actual mines and um, I might want to move it over to this, this area. Well, I don't know. It's hard to... Uh, it's tough because like the place at the beginning of the mines is nice because it leads me right to the elven zone I, I don't know man it's hard like it this game you could build some really cool bases but it's like you don't really do it because you have to move around so much so now um, press G to read entry uh, use the giant hoist to enter the descent, then keep going down. Below is the lower deeps and the pilgrim road. It is said to run from the center of Zirak Zigil all the way to the eastern stairs. And so this is the path I must seek. But first, I need to climb the way down into the deeps. The first descent is too far to jump. I will need to use this ancient hoist. What? What? What that mean? But yeah, like I, I feel like you don't ever build um, crazy bases here because you move around so much. Like there's so much you have to keep exploring. So like why would you have one base when you're going to have to uh, move on constantly? So wait, this isn't an elevator? It's like ladders? Why, what did I just rebuild, dude? I wanted a freaking... I wanted a freaking... Uh, Elevator. I thought this was it's a hoist. I thought it was gonna hoist me down. The fudge? The crystal descent is beautiful. But what's in the lower deeps? I'm worried, man. What is in the lower deeps? There's spiders down here, that's for sure. And I don't like that. These spiders are butts, man. How do I, uh, can I not get down? Um, let's see. Can I build something here? Wait, can I build a wood floor here? Oh, I just got, I just got frigged up. Spiders, of course. At least I have this hammer. Dude, they're frigging up my armor. Holy crap. This is so bad. But well, we're gonna get a lot of natural fibers. Alright, I'm at like half health. That's that's not too bad. Oh man, dude, that was bad. Wasn't expecting that. Destroy the eggs. 
We definitely want to destroy the eggs. Is there more egg spots? Uh, so like, what is what was my method to get back up? Like, is there is there a way that I'm supposed to? Am I supposed to just build a thing to get myself back up? I guess. Like, um, what can I build here? I can do like wood floors, right? Wood tile. Can I do stairs? I can do rough stairs. Small stairs. How do we turn it? T and R. Oh, I need a hearth to be able to even build. What about uh, just a plain wood floor? Can I build that? You need a wall. Frig, dude. What can I do here? Like, I can build stone walls. To, uh, hmm. Rope ladder. There we go. Build on a wall. Okay, so I need a wall. Yo, Sir Wolfwood's in the chat. How's it going, buddy? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? I'm out here with uh, Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. I just got... Oh, dude, today was a massive day for progress. So I finally got past the boss. I've been struggling to get past this boss. All I needed was to make this hammer and this shield. And it was easy peasy. And uh, so that got me to this next zone... Now, before I end this, I'm trying to figure out, like, I got to get down here, of course, but I also have to get back up to where I came from. And you need, like, a wall to build off of, so I'm trying to figure out, like, how I'm going to go about building here. Um, and, like, a lot of it, they want you to have a hearth to actually build. Oh my gosh, my player crashed. What I missed in the last 20 seconds? Oh, I was just uh, saying, so like I beat a boss today, which I had been struggling with for a long time. I just had to make me a new hammer, new shield. Uh, beating that boss got me to this next zone. I was able to come down here and uh, get to this next area where I got to explore. I got to get down to there. But I also have to like build a way to get myself back up. And so, like, it's it's weird building here because you need, like, a hearth to build. So it's, or a hearth, a hearth, hearth, whatever, however you say it. But, um, yeah, it wants you to have a wall to be able to build stairs, like, or to be able to build this rope ladder to build stairs, like, all this stuff. Yo, Wolfwood just subscribed? Holy schmoly. Here we go. Thank you, sir, Wolfwood, for getting us started. Much appreciated, dude. Heck yeah. I really appreciate that. Awesome of you. Uh, so yeah, I'm just trying to figure out like how I get back up. And I'm about to get attacked by freaking bats. God dang it. Menus. Eyes up. Monsters in the air. Yep, there's bats. Dude, this hammer is so sick though. It does like it does so much damage. Have you checked this out yet, Wolfwoods? Uh, Wolf says you're monetized. I can sub. Yeah, heck yeah, dude. I really appreciate it. My first sub. Uh, you've not yet checked this out. Uh, if you do, let me know. This is probably one that you would like. I mean, it's all the same stuff like crafting, survival, uh, exploration. Like, I think it's a lot of the stuff that you would like. And Lord of the Rings, obviously. Like, so if you check this out, let me know because, you know, we can, uh, you can do multiplayer on this. Think I'd enjoy it just so much to play these days, right? There's, there's, uh, way too many, way too many games. But I've been waiting for somebody else to get this because, like, the multiplayer. Uh, so, like, if there was ever a time when we could work it out, when we could play it together, like, that would be awesome. Because, uh, you know, like, I could come into your world and help you out you come to my world help me out like it'd be it'd be pretty cool be a lot of fun right right okay so yeah i do have to build a hearth hearth whatever you want to call it because uh i don't think i can build anything without that 
So, um, let's see. Where is that going to be at? Essentials. Stone hearth. Uh, I need coal. Fudge, I didn't bring any coal with me. I need coal. How the frig do they expect me to get back up? Dude, I have no means of getting back up. If I can't build a hearth without coal, I didn't bring any coal. A map stone. I could build a map stone. Worst case, Ontario. I build a map stone. I can fast travel out. Got to dip in and out here. Got to shower, get ready to stream myself here in like 20 minutes. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be here much longer either. Um, I'm just trying to figure my way out of this place, and then uh, I'm probably going to call it a day. But uh, I will see you. I'll probably stop in for your stream as well. Um, Fudge. Yeah, I have no coal, so I can't build a hearth. I, it doesn't look like I can build much here without the hearth. This, I think, I can build. So if I can build this, like if I build that there, then you need a wall. Okay, I can build it off of this wall. That can get me up to here. Then um, we can build the next step up, maybe. Can we just build like a next level up that I can climb up to? Wait, right there. Right freaking there. Oh, no, that doesn't stay. Dang it, dude. Why does that not stay? It crumbles. Dang it, dude. That sucks so bad. Can we build... Can I build this yet? You need to build this on a wall. Dang, dude. This is rough. Okay, what about... Can I build wood floor attached to here? To get me over to here? Okay, I can do that. Then, oh no, that's gonna crumble. God dang it, okay, can we do that? Is that gonna crumble? Doesn't crumble, okay, then can we do a rope ladder? Build on a wall, okay, can I build like some kind of wall? How do I build a wall without having a hearth? That needs a hearth. Maybe... Platform? Build near a hearth. A uh, narrow platform. Yeah, see this stuff is needing a hearth. Stone column? Dang, dude. This is rough. Oh, stairs. I can build stairs, right? No, that needs hearth. What about... Uh, can I do, like, a level up wood floor? No, why does that crumble? There's got to be a way. Okay, so we've done... No, that just built onto there. God dang it. Let's deconstruct that. That right there. And let's pick that back up. Hmm, this is tough. This is tough. What if I build... I'm really, like, 
making a monstrosity here just trying to get my way back up. I don't think I even needed that. Uh, let's see, how do I destroy again? Um, X is deconstruct. Let's deconstruct that. That somehow gives you a stone foundation. How the heck does that work out? I'm thinking we build attached to that. Why is that not working? Just trying to build like a pathway here. Build that. Why is attaching to that not working? That's so weird. Like it wants it attached to a wall. You attach it to a wall and it does butt stuff. Now if we build one up. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Dude. I just got to get up to there. The spiders really frig me. Wait, is there cold that I can gather here? Is that actually... Was this cold the whole time? I don't think that's coal. I'm not really mining anything from that. There's got to be, like, coal here. I'm probably going to mine coal from this. Getting stone. I did get coal. Okay, so we might be able to build a hearth here. Tin. How much coal did I get? I don't even see it. Where the frig is my coal? I swear I picked up coal, right? Where is it? Oh, it's oh, it's in my inventory bar. I see. Okay, how much do I need for a hearth? Because I like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to get out of here if I don't build a hearth. So I'm kind of stuck trying to mine here and pick up some stuff to be able to get out of here. Ooh, we get some honey. Sick. Gonna make some mead down here. Nice, 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 nice. Alright, let's see. Do I have enough for the hearth? What is the hearth costing me? Maybe like a simpler hearth, right? Yeah, I can make the camp hearth. Okay, so that's good. That gives me at least the ability to build, I think. So we'll go ahead and we'll just throw that down there. So now I should be able to build my stuff. Uh, we're going to grab that. I can also deconstruct that. And we can grab some more stuff down here. Okay, now I should at least be able to get my way up, I think. Like, if we build the small stairs. Build on a floor, build near a hearth. So I'm by a hearth. Why is this not... Why is this not working? Do you really have to be within that square to build are you kidding me what does it cost oh god dang it dude what does it cost to build the next level hearth you need 15 okay can I like deconstruct this and get my coal back six coal okay ah fudge dude that's butts we got a mine. Yo, what up, Barcode? Welcome back, buddy. Trying to get some uh, some coal here. I'm having a, a bit of a struggle. I gotta, like... Somehow I gotta build a hearth here so I can build my way back up. I'm kind of stuck down here. 
Unless I can get enough coal to build me a hearth to get my way back up. Because for whatever reason, you can't just build, like, s simple structures with, uh... You can, the only thing you can build without a hearth is, um... Your floors. So I'm a little bit, uh... A little bit in trouble here. How was your, uh... Your work? I just killed him with a pickaxe. I didn't mean to. I was trying to switch to a uh, hammer, but it didn't really work out. I think I still got to get something to be able to mine this. No, I can mine jewels. I can get true quartz. Oh. Yo, I can get true quartz. Uh, inventory's full, though, so let's... Mm, let's ditch something. Let's ditch some metal fragments. God dang it, bats. You dumb idiots. Why are you even attacking me right now? Let's crack, th crack this open. See if we get a little bit of coal. Now, did I get any coal? I got eight coal. I need 15. Fudge. What is this? This looks like a pile of coal. Why is that not a pile of coal? Is this a pile of coal? Dude, that literally looks like a pile of coal, does it not? What is wrong with this? Please give me coal. I know you're not coal ore, but please give me something. I didn't know I needed to bring it. Today some woman screamed when she seen the snake in a hotel. She was so scared of it, even if it was non-venomous house snake. For catching it, releasing it in nature, she reported me for animal. Oh, that sucks. Animal cruelty got fined $100. Dang. What kind of snake was it? Yeah, I mean, some people that ain't never seen real, like, nature, they're, they're going to be a little bit, you know, they're going to be wary of that stuff. Okay, let's, all right, maybe what I do, we build the camp hearth here, like, directly under that, and then we can build maybe a ladder. Not a ladder, but a uh, staircase. Build near hearth. I'm doing that. I'm going to build it like directly over the hearth. Can I build it? Can I not build it? Wait, there we go. There we go. Yo. Why did it crumble? Why the fudge does it crumble? But for helping her, I got fined $100. What a stupid... Yeah, dude, that is crap. That's a bummer. Wait, what we can do now, though, we can build a wall. Then we can build... Oh, I think I got it now. Now I can build this. And so that way... I think I should be able to get back up. What if I build it on the other side? What if I go over here? Yeah, like I said, some people, like, they're, I don't know, they're, they're scared of that stuff or whatever, and so they're going to they're gonna be butts about it no matter what you do to try and help them, you know? What if I build that? Then uh, I jump up. Okay, sick. Okay, now we have a way up. All right, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> 
all that just to find a way to get back up. Now, I think I need to build fudge. $100 less in my wallet for helping a person. What a sad world we live in. Absolutely, man. Right. That's how it be sometimes, man. People are people are frigged up. There we go. Now we build that. Now we can climb our way back up. Oh, finally. That's all I wanted to accomplish. We got we got a lot accomplished today. Beat a boss, got down into this new zone. It's like, man, I just want to be able to get my way back up. So that way I know I'm going to be able to get my stuff back, you know? Or get back to my stuff at least. We finally did it. Alrighty, well, uh, anyways, guys, I am going to go ahead and call it a day for today's streams, for today's episode of Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button down below. Helps me out a bunch. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notifications so that way you're not going to miss out on any future streams or videos. Join Discord if you want to come by and chat. And if you want to help support the channel on YouTube, 99 cents to become a member. Helps out a bunch. Gets you a bunch of cool perks. You get access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server. Join when you want or with me on Fridays. We're going to be starting Season 3 as soon as Minecraft 1.21 comes out. So be sure to keep a lookout for that stuff. Also, if you want to help support, you can buy some merch. We got the shirts. Sleeveless shirts now available for summer. We got hats. Uh, ball caps, beanies, all that kind of stuff. Check that out if you want to help support that way. But anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. Hopefully I will see you in the next one. Peace.